Hi, I'm Dr. Tony Nettleman, and today we're talking about why land surveyor licensing is important to the public. I'm one of these people who dislikes over-regulation. I think there's a lot of regulations, a lot of laws on the books, and a lot of them are not even relevant today. On the other hand, there are some occupational codes that are meant to protect the public. How far that goes is really up to you. Because on one side, we've got occupational codes for doctors. On the other side, we've got occupational codes for interior designers. I mean, can you imagine the harm someone could do by pairing a colored drape with a couch? I mean, terrifying. But for real, land surveyors occupy a space somewhere in the middle between doctors and interior designers. And I feel like it's more toward the doctor, less toward the interior designer, because imagine the harm that could be caused by a reckless or an untrained land surveyor. A lot of professions, engineers, contractors, builders, architects, I mean, you just name it, they rely on land surveyors. And do these professions really understand how we do our job? A little bit, but not so much. And when we as a professional land surveyor produce a map, these related professions simply rely on it. You know, I'm dealing with a case in Dallas where a setback has to be shown before they build a house. Well, there are three different ways you can calculate the setback based on different evidence in the neighborhood. I won't get into it, but the builders really do not understand those three different methods, and they don't know why or how land surveyors pick one of those three. They just rely on it. But at the same time, we as land surveyors have this obligation to produce good work because everybody relies on what we do. We're the first ones in, we're the last ones out. So the public expects to get a certain quality product. And if land surveying was not licensed and regulated, I'm not sure the clients would get that quality. Now, what do you guys think? Do you think we should have licensed or unlicensed land surveyors? Comment below and let's get a discussion going.